Can you hear me clearly? Oh, you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. How are you today? Um, I'm uh, fine, and you? I'm great. Now, did you already went to school? Just like the others? Yes. Wow, that's nice. So you're going to school in the morning and having a lesson at night. That's very hard working of you. Okay. So can you still remember the lesson or the story that we read before? Remember? The buckle up and leap. Can you still remember what happened to this story? Uh the it uh, happened it uh, uh in April last year. Uh I was traveling through a remote arena uh, area in a van with my uh, medical team. On the way, uh, an our driver sped up, up to a curb on the one side, lost control of our bicycle. Vehicle? Vehicle and crashed head on with a bus coming from the opposite. Opposite? Direction, opposite direction. The accident was extremely 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 serious my below the knee ah, I, my no. leg was so badly crushed that it had to be amputated below the knee over however it's great for Except. a small Expect for a small excess yes. for a superficial cut on my forehead. There were no injuries to my head or chuck, so I will eventually be able to return to my me medical career. Oh, Event row, I lost a leg due to you, due to the carelessness of one driver. My left, my life was safe because I had broke up, buckled up, buckled up. Yes, okay, again. So, before we answer some questions, what is buckled up again? It is when you wear when uh, you're inside the car. Uh, I wear the I think uh, I wear in the car. Yeah, it's a, a, a like a long belt. What do you call that one? Put it on your body. What do you call that one? It starts with S. And it has belt at the last. What do you call that one? Okay, we call that one as seat belt. Yes, do you know what is a seat belt? Uh, I think seat belt is a uh, set uh, is uh, uh, help me. Uh, it uh, kept me safe uh, my life when uh, the vice, um, the car, uh, uh, the car is uh, it, uh, it broke. Okay. Yes, that is a seat belt, the one that you will put on your body to keep you safe. Okay. How about a remote area? Can you still remember what remote area is? A uh, remote area is a... 
A far? Uh, I go a far. I go far. Yes, a far place that is a remote area. How about amputated? Uh, I don't know. Okay, I'll give you an action. If my finger is broken, I need the doctor amputate. The doctor amputate. What is amputate? If you have broken finger, the doctor needs to amputate. It means... I don't know. Okay. Amputate means to cut or get those broken bones of your body. That is amputate. Being cut or being get through operations by a doctor. That is it. Okay, now I think we shall begin with our questions. So question number one, are you ready? Yes. Okay. Number one is when was the incident or the accident happened? When we say when, it talks about the time or the day. So again, when was the incident happen? Uh, uh, it happened in, uh, uh, in April last year. I was traveling through a remote area in a van with my medical team. On the way, I was up to a car uh, on the wrong side, lost control of our Okay, so it happened in April? Last year. Yes. Okay, next question. Who were, who were the team or group of people traveling to a remote area? When you say who, it talks about a group of people or a people. So again, my question is who are the group or team? Team when traveling to a remote area, who are they? I think it's a uh, group. Uh, I think it's a uh, group. Yes. What kind of group? Uh, I think the group you have uh, many people uh, to make uh, something. Okay. The group that travels to a remote area is the. It's the medical team. They travel to a remote area. Again, who went? Who travels to a remote area? It's the medical team. Okay. Next question. What vehicle? What vehicle does the medical team ride? What kind of vehicle? Uh, a kind of the vehicle is a medical team rides uh, on the way our driver sped up to a car on the strong side, not control a vehicle and crashed head on with a bus coming from the opposite direction. Okay, so the the vehicle they ride is okay it's a van yes they ride in a van that's what vehicle they ride okay next question based on the story what was the reason or what happened why they had an accident Who's at fault or what happened? Why they had an accident? Um, uh, because uh, on the way, our drivers went up to a car on the strong side, lost control of our vehicle and crashed head on with my bus coming from 
the opposite the direction. That's very good because of one driver who speeds up or who drives fast, fast and took a wrong curve and they crashed with another bus coming. Okay, next question. Again, based on the story, was the accident extremely serious? Yes or no? Was it serious? Extremely serious? Yes or no? Yes. Yes, because it says here, the, the accident, accident was extremely serious. Yes, it means it's very bad. It's very serious. Okay, next question. Okay, we're done with this one. What happened to the leg of one passenger? What happened to the one leg of a passenger? It was it was uh, extremely serious. Mm -hmm. And the uh, left leg was so badly crushed that it had to be amputated below the knee. Yes. The one leg of, of, of the passenger was badly crushed that the doctor needs to cut or amputate below the knee. Okay. Now let's go to the next question. Okay. Why do you think people often neglect to fasten their seatbelts? Do you know what is neglect? Do you have any idea what is it? Um, I think it's a... Uh, uh, I think it's a uh, we don't uh, um I, I think it's we don't uh, uh I don't know. Okay, you're almost there. We don't but you know the neglect, but you cannot explain. Am I right? Yes. Okay. Neglect is a person who don't care or don't mind. They just don't want it that is neglect why do why do you think people often neglect to fasten their seatbelt why does other people based on you why does other people just don't mind or don't care putting seat belts when they ride a vehicle um because uh, people often neglect to fasten the seat belts because uh, it uh, helped me uh, um, save my life when the car uh, uh, crashed head on. Okay. How about those people who forget or who don't like putting seat belts? What happened to them? Um, uh, uh, people don't put they sit down so um, when, uh, when uh, the first sea crashed head on, uh, the people will, uh, will had an? Uh, will broke, uh, broken the bone and uh, go to heart hospital, hospital. Yes, very good. If they don't put seat belts, they will have an accident and it might bring them or they might bring or the doctor needs to amputate them in the hospital, okay? Number two, what do you think are the main reasons for traffic accidents? What is the reason why there is a traffic accident? Can you give me a few? Reasons why there will be accidents happen in roads. Uh, uh, I think it's um, um, I don't know. Okay, I'll give you one. Just like what happened in this story, 
one driver speed up. He drive fast. That's why they had an accident. What other reasons aside from riding fast? What do you think are other reasons? Uh, uh, reasons is uh, loss of my they loss of control. Uh, they lost control of our vice vehicle and crashed head on with a bus coming from the opposite opposite direction. Opposite. Yes. Okay. There. If you drive fast, you will lose control and it might give you a traffic accident. Aside from driving fast, another reason for having a traffic accident is when you are drunk, drinking alcohol, drinking bad drinks. Okay. Do you know what is drunk? Do you know this word? Um, I think it's the uh, um, I think it same uh, drink. Yes, drink. It's just the past tense of drunk. Okay, if person is drunk, of. Okay, do you know this word? Um, I don't know. Alcohol drinks. The okay, alcohol drinks are bad drinks that are not suitable for um, children. So if you drink this one while driving, you will you cannot drive properly because you drink alcohol and that is a bad way while driving because you are drunk. You cannot see the road properly. Okay, another yes. reason. Yes? Yes. Okay, another reason is, is it okay to text while driving? You text while driving? Is it okay or not? Um, I think it's uh, not. Oh, why do you think it is not okay? Because... Um, because, uh, what happened if you were texting while driving? What will happen to you? Uh, I have happened, uh, I don't know. Okay. If you are texting while driving, that means... You are focused on texting and you cannot see the road. You cannot see your way. And you cannot see if there is a, another vehicle coming to you and you are texting. So you and the other vehicle will crash and had an accident. That's That will happen if you keep on texting while driving. Okay. Now, last question. Have you seen an accident? Or a traffic accident in your entire life? Have you already seen an accident? Um, uh, yes. Yes. What happened to that accident? Or what happened? I see uh, the car uh, crash the motorbike. And the people in motorbike uh, fall in, uh, under the car. Oh, that was very bad. Who were the people riding on the motorbike? What are people, these people in the uh, motorbike is so lucky. Uh, so uh, the car um, uh, doesn't uh, go in, uh, in the, these people. Oh, I see. So they are they rushed to the hospital or no? Um, um yes. I see. So it has very... a blood one bar. Okay, so let's be upset. Right? 
um, uh, look, um, here I saw a uh, scary, oh. um, and, um, and I, um, and my father and my mother, uh, called the hospital, uh, to help my people. Oh, that was, that was a very good action that your mother and father made. Okay, you need to keep it up, okay? You need to keep on helping other people. Did you already help a peep up another people? Yes. Oh, what did you do with that peep what with that person? I will help person if they uh, need to go to the uh, hospital and I think. Okay, I see. Now, how about in school? Do you, do you already help someone in school? Yes. Oh, that's very nice. So you are very, uh, you're a very helpful person. Okay, now let's go first before we proceed to another topic. Let's learn new words. Okay, now the first word is? Terrible. Yes, terrible. Terrible. Yes. And do you know what is a terrible? Um, I think uh, terrible is, is a food uh, is, uh, not good. Yes, not good or very bad or extremely bad. Yes, or serious. That is terrible. Now, how about, can you give me a sample sentence with a use terrible? Um, um, I eat the first uh, so terrible. Again, can you say it one more time? I eat the food so terrible. Okay, I eat the fruit. I eat the I eat the fruit it is so terrible. Okay, we will add I eat the fruit and it is so terrible. Okay, you say it this way. Yes. I eat the fruit and it is so terrible. I eat the food and it's so terrible. Yes. Okay, now let's go to the next word, which is... What is this? Gymmit. Okay, again, one more time. Gymmit. Okay. And gymmit, it is... To foresee open with a piece of metal. Okay, gymmit is when you force it open. You open it without asking permission. You just open it with a sharp metal. For example, a, a lock. For example, this one. Okay, for example, this is the lock. You just open the lock with a very sharp thing. For example, a needle or sharp thing. Then you open the lock coarsely. And that is a gymmit. Opening a lock without asking permission. For example, the sentence here. The tervous gymnast, the back door. And got it. Yes, the thieves. Can you say it? Thieves. The thief. Thief. Okay. It is. Okay, do you know what is a thieves? Thieves? Do you I know what? Know. Okay, how about this one? Do you know this person? Um. Yes. Yes, okay. Thief is a past tense for thieves or not a past tense but a plural if thief is one thieves is many okay many people who get money or whatever they want from someone that is thief and thieves they are just the same okay now let's go to the next word oh Yes. Do you know this one? Um, 
I think is um same order. <laughs> okay. Odd is it's not a mathematical odd. Okay, odd is strange or unusual. Strange. Strange or unusual. Unusual. Okay, this means that it is not usual thing that happened or not familiar. They are very strange. That is odd. For example, I'll give you a sample sentence. Uh, okay, can you make one or I'll make one? Can you do it? Making a sample sentence with the word odd means strange or not usual. Uh, um, uh, I see the people in the... I see the people's is art. Okay. I see the people are art. Yes. Okay. Nice example. Now let's go to the next word. Okay, there's one. Scare Okay. Let's read it slow. Scra. Scra. Okay. Scra. Scra. Very good. Scratch. Scratch. Okay. Again, one more time. Scratch. Very good. And that is. Scrap. Make the subway with sharp object. Okay, for example, when you rub, when you scratch your finger and it will leave a mark, that is a scratch. Or when you rub, it will leave something on your body and that is a scratch. Now let's move to curse. Okay, we read this one as accused. Accused. Yes. And do you know what is accused? Um, I think accused is uh, um, I think accused is uh, um, I think the people is uh, I don't know. Okay, but you know this word. Yes. Okay. Accused is when you do find fault blame. Yes, you find fault or you blame that person. For example, can you give me a sample sentence with the word accused or blaming a person? I I I accuse this uh this people is uh, uh, these people EQ is Q my friend. Is this? No. Not this word? Rescue? Of course. Oh. These people. Okay. These let me. People. Accuse. This one? Yes. Okay. Let's Very see. good. Again, let's read these people. These people accuse my friend. Accused. Accuse my friend. Okay, that is accused or blaming a person, making him um, have a mistake. Okay, since 30 minutes is already um, there, so 
Let's just continue with other words. Next meeting. Okay. So yeah. we will just continue okay. learning new words. So thank you for cooperating. See you tomorrow. Goodbye. Goodbye.